our uh, energetic, kind, and uh, very supportive director, Director General, Director of the Sir. To Major Father Ray A. Ibanez, our chaplain. Mr. Lieutenant Colonel Aisa Sita San Antonio, our ARD. Other officers present, members of uh, the Sinaglaya class of uh, 2002 who are present. Well, thank you for coming. Chief Aristius, nandito po yung mga uh, Aristius 1. Nabili na itong mag-attend sir kasi nag-attend ako nung ano niya eh. Nung nangyadong ano niya, ako lang nag-attend. So, nag-consensya yata si classmate. So, thank you mate ma'am for uh, uh, being with us this afternoon. Nandito rin po yung ating na, uh, aking classmate sir na R2 ng uh, Region 5. Very soon to be this Colonel uh, Jose Oliver Wenderholm Soriano the Fourth. yung aking po nga company commander ng aming uh, kalit days kasabay ko rin na promote sir from uh, finance service police colonel uh, Valdez of course yung uh, loving wife o uh, kay ko promote si uh, Anyo may mga thank you for coming out po uh, yung aking po nga naging kapalitan sa STU 2 and 3 Sir Nelson Vallejo, Sir We also have the Chief of uh, uh, Aristillo Cordillera, Sir Lugan the upper class Sir Makasil Other officers, present PNCOs Of course, my family and uh, my support group Thank you also for uh, being with me today Sa lahat po na nandito Isang magpapalang hapon po sa ating lahat. First, I humbly and joyfully accept the promotion bestowed upon me by the Philippine National Police. Also, let me congratulate my fellow officer and friend, Police Colonel Christopher de la Peña, who I believe shared the same joy and gratitude that I am feeling today. Last weekend, I was trying to have my thoughts for this message when I looked at my new uniform and found a perfect metaphor that three sampagita flowers which will adorn my shoulders. Declared as national flower of the Philippines in 1934, these smelling flowers symbolizes not only purity but also humility and strength. The same virtues that stand as our pillars as we continue with our journey as public servant. Purity and intention of serving our country. Humility in dealing with our fellow men in his strength to overcome life adversities. My journey as a public servant all began with a broken pencil. Ito po yung pwede sa'yo kung bakit ako nating naging pulis. My journey as a public servant all began with a broken pencil. It was a week after a strong typhoon hit my hometown, source of all, when the entrance examination for PNPA cadets were held. I did not receive a notice, yet I still took my chance. So I went to the testing center with hope that my name is included in the list. I waited long, but pessimism hit me. Hence, I turned my back and walked out of the camp. While walking away, I suddenly remembered my father, why Senator Lewis is with me now, who woke up at 1.30 in the morning just to prepare my breakfast, and who accompanied me to the bus stop, armed with love and support for a son dreaming to be a part of the nation 
Premier Police Academy. I ask myself the question, pag umuwi ako, ano ang sasabihin ko sa tatay ko? So I hurriedly went back to the testing center and as I was approaching one of the rooms, I heard my name being called out. I was qualified to take the entrance test. But I had one problem. I did not bring a pencil with me. True enough, God works in mysterious ways. A co-applicant willingly broke his pencil into two and shared the other half with me. Opinion to po ng kasamaan ko doon yung kanyang lapis na pinigay sa aking mesa. Though I received the end without an eraser, I came to realize that it is our it is through our fellow men's profound gesture that God manifests himself. And the rest is history. And here I am, standing in front of you, sharing my humble story. That experience taught me that in our line of service, sometimes we need to break the, pen, the only pencil that we have so that others may write their own life story and tread the path distant for them. Ang sabi nga ni Olaf sa Prozen, some people are worth melting for. According to Isaac Newton, and I quote, If I have seen farther, it is by standing on the shoulders of giants. This moment, therefore, I would like to acknowledge everyone who has been instrumental in getting me to where I am now. I sincerely thank our Director, Regular General of the Italian Professor, for your trust and excellent leadership. Your example continue to inspire us to become the best version of ourselves as individuals and leaders. Moreover, I offer my sincere gratitude to retired Major General Ronaldo Cabral, who with wisdom and discernment guided me through life's highs and lows. My appreciation also goes to dedicated and outstanding men and women of RSTU and training service, and my beloved class, PNP, PNPA Sinaglaya. May I also take this opportunity to thank my parents, Mr. and Mrs. David Dalo, Engineer and Mrs. Eusebio El Liponso, my support group from Bicol and Kriba Vizcaya, my brothers, sisters and friends for the love and encouragement. Special mention to my loving and beautiful wife, Raizel. who despite my shortcomings, continue to be my happy peel in the wind beneath my wings. Lastly, to my daughters, Lane Oriel and Cheka Amira, thank you for making fatherhood one of the best duties in the world. Most importantly, I praise our Almighty God for all the blessings He has bestowed upon me and my family. May everything we do serve as an opportunity to glorify His name. Kanina ng nagkakapi po ako, naalala ko yung patalastas ng Nescafe na may tagline, para kanino ka gumabang. Gaano man kahaba ang sagot ko sa katanungang iyon, isa lamang ang naikitong puntuhin. Tayo ay nagubuhay para sa kapwa. Natututo hindi lamang para sa ating mga sarili at umuunla para sa mas na ikabubuti. May this another milestone in our career inspire us to further implement and oversee crucial initiative aimed at improving public safety and, and security in our communities. I will try my best to meet, our, to meet your expectations through perseverance, resiliency, and adaptability. 
all of which I deem will have a positive impact on the law enforcement profession. Sabi nga sa voice and commercial, equality you can trust. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this occasion serves as a rite of passage that evokes good feelings of excitement and fear. The road ahead is challenging, but I pray that my capacity for hard work and sacrifice will help the police service in achieving its noble goals. With the help of God, the PNP, my superiors, colleagues, and my family and friends, I intend to continue writing the pages of my life story to chronicle the highlights, the falls and victories, all encompassing this once in a lifetime opportunity. May I end by sharing this nugget of wisdom by Henry Ford. Coming together is the beginning. Keeping together is progress. Working together is success. Thank you very much for listening. Just Mabalos, Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much for sharing with us the humble story of the journey of you.